All right, we're going to take a trip through the sewers and get the uh, Lord of Blood's Exaltation. We're going to go fight Esker. I might actually go and get more Golden Seeds, too. Because, uh... God's can do is pretty rough. Not going to lie. How the hell? I'm trying to remember how to actually get to the sewers this way. I think the well's over here somewhere. I'm not used to this. Uh, or not? Where the hell is it? Oh, it's right here. Like, I never go to the sewer until after the capital's burning, and it's so much easier to enter. Which is the whole reason I don't do those bosses until, like, the end of the run, because I gotta open, like, three doors here. And by three, I mean two? I think there's one more to open. Either way, it's just, like, more time, you know? Yeah, like another... I, I, I would love to get, like, another couple flasks. I have zero golden seeds, though, right now. And I actually have to think about which ones I've got and which ones I need to get. I think we can get one near Godric. There's one in the Weeping Peninsula. Nothing here, though. Oh, we do have, uh, there's ulcerated tree spirits we could kill for some. I forgot about that. Yeah, this run's definitely gonna be on the longer side, that's for sure. <laughs> I don't know how long it's gonna take to get through a new game, but... God's Skin Duo is just awful. I knew they'd be bad, though. I'm just like running through all the locations in my head for the golden seeds. Can I make this? I don't think so. Yeah. Also gotta remember to uh, like put something on the physic because I, to this point, have continued to forget. Having another heal there would be huge. So, like, the key, I think, to this is, like, whenever we get bleeds, we need to be super aggressive. Not super aggressive, but, like, more aggressive. Because we have the thing. We get a damage bonus, basically, whenever you get a bleed for, like, 20 seconds. Oh, 
Oh my god, stop. I can't believe the dogs didn't die. Also got blown up immediately. I was at full health and then just got eviscerated. Well, attack's actually, like, super nice for his NPCs. Big fan. God, that's over half my health in one hit? That's disgusting. I think I bled, actually. That's probably why. Dead. Yeah, I've had it with these guys and stupid blood flies. Oh my god, that's so good for bleeding. I gotta use that more. Alright, I guess we'll go around and find uh, some golden seeds. There's one in the Weeping Peninsula. I think there's only one in the Weeping Peninsula, actually. I'm trying to think of another one. But nothing has come to mind. You could always do, like, some other bosses, too, for some extra souls. Which I, I don't usually do, I just, but it, it wouldn't be a bad idea. Like, we could go do Radon for, like, 80k. Some stuff in the mountaintops, or the snowfield, that stuff would give a lot. The only thing I don't really want to do is, like, waste any stone sword keys on, uh... ...on things, like, trying to get, like, uh, golden seeds or something. Like, uh, the French Volkira's Grave, the Ulcerated Tree Spirit there, I don't want to... I want to do that. Let's go to uh, Stormvale. There's two golden seeds we can get in Stormvale, actually. I think there are two in Fair Missoula. One of them is after Godskin Duo, though, and the other one's behind a Stone Sword Key Door, so probably not going to get any there. Take a trip to Gelmir. I know there's some golden seeds. Well, we got the ulcerated tree spirit, plus there's a golden seed in Seath Water. And near uh the entrance of Volcano Manor. I think you can survive that. I haven't been down here in a while. I think the randomizer was like the last time.
And even this thing has an insane amount of health when you hit it with this. Like, Jesus Christ. Scene. Oh, I'm at the level. Alright, where else? Um, Kaelid? No ulcerated tree spirit, but... There's one golden seed on the way to Radon. I guess we'll just go to Radon, too. Why not? Get more souls. Golden seed and Celia. is the wrong way. Actually, I think we can go this way. Okay. I don't think I ever got this. So, how many do we have? Like, two right now? Three, okay. So we need... We need eight and we can get another two flasks. And then 18 for max, but I don't I don't think it will. I don't know if I want to go to... I, it'd be great to have 14, don't get me wrong. But... It's a lot of... Tracking down things we're gonna need to do if we, if we want to do that. A lot of gold seeds. I think we'll go to Redon, though. I don't need this shield on anymore. I'll put it back on for Godseen Duel, but right now we don't need it. Nor do we really need this. Like, the only time I'm probably going to use those are for Godseen Duo. And then what do we want? Do we want more Arcane, I guess? Well, Kenneth Hike gives uh, gold seeds if you kill him. Forgot about that. So that's four, right? Oh, it's five. Right, I got Telia too. Oh, you know what? The Ulcerated Tree Spirit in Gelmir, I don't think actually drops a Golden Seed. Well, I can't remember. I can't remember. I know you get the, um, you get some Physic tiers, but I don't know that you get a Golden Seed there. So this is like 80, or is it 70k? I think it's 70k souls. Echoes. Echoes? Wrong game. Uh, souls isn't right, but like Echoes is like completely wrong. Rune.
Then Lyurnia. I know there's some golden seeds I didn't get. Be great to have like 13. I think that's definitely uh, a little more doable. 14 is doable. It's just I feel like I'm going to have to go pretty far out of my way to get another five. Oh, we might as well do War Dead, right? That's actually, this works out. I didn't even think about that. And I guess I could go to the Church of Inhibition. I don't normally like to, but we're desperate. Dude, I can't hit him. I'm too tiny. Good old bleed. Yeah, where are you going? God, blood tax is so good for bleeding. Right, we should be close to a bleed, I think. What about Nokrod? I'm trying to think of if there are any golden seeds there. I know there is in Shifra. That's so far out of the way, though, man. Three more for two flasks, then we need another five after that for another one. I think there's some of the mountaintops I didn't get. At least one. There's one in the snow field, and I really don't want to go there. That's just so far out of the way. Like, I feel like normally when I do these runs, I try to stick to, like, a very similar path through New Game, but this, this one, we're just kind of throwing everything out the window, and anything is fair game to get stronger. But I still don't want to go to the snowfield. All right, we want more arcane. I feel like that's not really going to add much. I'd rather go more vigor, honestly. Like getting to sixty, I think, would be more helpful than going more arcane because I don't think the damage is going to get much better. Sixty vigor though would go a long way. I don't think we'll get sixty before Don Skin Duo, but fifty would uh, be nice. We need a lot more souls for that though. We'd probably have to go to the snowfield for that. 
and just kill some bosses there. Like, dude, Theodorix. Um, what else? Knight's Cavalry duo we can do. No, this way. It's this way. Dude, even these guys still, like, shred your health. Nice cavalry duo is annoying, but like they're easy. Just want to use this to get to full health real quick. Okay, never mind. I guess we're gonna heal. land a hit. My god. Thank you. I land every hit. Nice. Good old axe talisman. How about a repost? No? That's fine. Whatever. I don't need it. This guy should give like a decent amount of souls too, I would think. I hope. I guess I don't really know. Never really paid attention to it. Explosion? No, I get. Now? Now. Kinda weird you can bleed trees. I feel like they shouldn't bleed. I mean I'm all for it, don't get me wrong, but it just feels kinda weird. What are you doing? Golden Seed and 64k. That's less than Red Dawn. That is a. I don't like that. Uh, anywhere else in Kaylee with a Golden Seed? I don't think so. I think we got the two that were there. We got obviously the boss here. What about. Limgrave? Try to think of one. We got the one on the way to Margit. Got the one in Weeping. I think, I think, I don't know, I can't think of another one. He also had a Tree Spirit in French Folk, but I don't want to do that. We'll go here. I can think of two in Liernia. There's one by, I guess they're kind of both by the entrance of Ray Lucaria, which I don't think I ever got the... Actually, let's go here. Probably faster. Uh, there's one in Karia Manor. That's super out of the way, but maybe we should just do it. I know there's one in Lindell that I never grabbed. The 
the one near the gargoyle that I try to stay away from. Like, having three extra flasks, I think, will be super huge in this fight. And more health, ideally. What do we uh, need to level? 29k, okay. Maybe we will go to the snowfield and we'll just kill some bosses there and then uh, try and get as much health as possible. There's a Golden Seed in Rey Lucari. I don't think I got. So we can get that too. There's a dungeon in the mountaintops. An ulcerated tree spirit. It's pretty long, but... I might even give two uh, things. There we go. We're going... Actually, we're going this way. Is this right? I think it's to the left, actually. Somewhere. Oh, no, it's right there. You can see it. Uh, okay, in Ray Lucaria. And then I guess we could just run through Kari Mana real quick. Should probably level up here, though. But yeah, doing like some of the snowfield bosses, you get like 200,000 uh, runes for those things. It it's like so, so many. It's so worth doing here, I think. Somehow missed this. means I know I didn't get this. Um, I guess here. We gotta do Nile though, if we're gonna do the snowfield. And I gotta go kill what's his face, Albus. I don't really wanna fight any death rate birds. Those things just like. Have s they don't bleed, I'm pretty sure. Maybe I should just get this grace. <laughs> I keep coming back here. It's funny too, like I don't think this thing has been that bad outside of Godskin Duo. Like it's been it's been definitely not ideal, but as long as you can bleed things, you're fine. When you can't, that's when you have problems. I might be dead here. Oh nice. Never mind. I thought I jumped from a little, like, too high up. I forgot to grab the Grace by EG, so we gotta do this again. But yeah, I'm thinking we can do Theodorix. We could probably do... Let's sing the Knight's Cap duo, which is gonna take a while, but... Uh, what else? We do Moog, actually. We're right there. That would give, like, 400k. 400... I think it's 400, actually, exactly. Maybe we'll do that next. Let's get the... Uh, I guess we'll get this Golden Seed, and then we'll go do Moog. Need four more.
We're gonna be like so much more over prepared for like the start of New Game Plus than I normally am. It's gonna be weird. My damage is still gonna be bad, but I'm gonna have like so much health. So many golden seeds and sacred tears. I guess we can do the uh, other sacred tier too. I didn't get. I don't think there are going to be many runs like this where we're just like getting materials, but they're definitely going to happen every now and then. For the most part, like you can just go from like like once you get your upgrade materials for the weapon anyway like it's just bosses what gods can do is just like a really annoying damage check Let's go to Moog. I also have remembrances I can pop too. Forgot about these. Should be like three levels maybe? Hopefully. Boom. No fire damage on this thing. It's pure physical. That's good, because smoke is resistant to fire. Two bleeds already. Oops, that was greedy. Also greedy. Brother, dude, can I just heal? Wow, I actually got well.
pats, dude. Now, how did what? Like, man, the button. Oh my god, that bleed. Luckily, it, it came in a good time because I didn't get staggered. I, I got staggered, but like. It was like early. If it was like a half a second later, I probably would have been dead. Oh my god. How do you fight Moog? Oh, come on. This game is just like eating my inputs right now. This is so frustrating. Stagger here? No. Man, I swear to God, like, he, he, sometimes he just idles and I do an R1 just because, like, I get impatient, and then as soon as I R1, he doesn't attack. It's happened so many times in this fight. Dude, the lock-on just failed me. Any other bleeds? Nothing. Yeah, dude. Quite a lot in this fight, though. There we go. Sweet. Oh, it's 420. Right. Forgot. Damn. All the way to 60 already. Just off of that. That's actually insane. All right. Uh, how many more golden seeds do I need? I need three more. Okay. Let's think. I assume I got the one in the Forbidden Lands. Gelmir we could uh, go get. There's two in Gelmir.
think there's one of the mountaintops. There's probably actually, you know, there's, you know, we're not doing that. We're going to go. I know where we can get like two of them. I didn't get a single grace here. Are you s I'm so stupid, man. Why? Why am I like this? Especially to run like this, like I should have like thought about it more. So there's this one. I guess we'll go back to. Uh... I don't know. I don't know what how would it be fat like would it be faster to go across the lake from here or from the other side. Probably the other side. So we need two more. Actually, you know, it might be faster from this side. Sixty vigor for gods can do. Oh, that will be nice. I think it's like an extra, like four hundred, plus another like three flasks. Oh, the sacred tier. I forgot about the sacred tier too. I'll go grab that. I don't think I got the golden seed. Uh, I don't know what, like on the other side of the lake. I don't think I got it. Then we can avoid going to the snow field. I'd rather not go there. <laughs> well, the, the, the 60 vigor, like, I think I, I think we'll be fine without it. I mean, the only other things I can really do to make the build better would be stamina or endurance or more stamina and then uh, arcane. But I don't think it's going to make it much better. So it's like, what's the point? Dude, where am I? Why is it so... It is never this foggy here. Like, on the lake, sure. Off the lake, though? I think, like, the... I can see. Thank goodness. Okay, the golden seed over here, I don't think I got. And then we just need what? Two more or one more? One more. Did I get this? Maybe I did. Oh, that sucks. All right. Um, let's think then. Could do Yelmir, I guess. I feel like there's probably one. In fact, I know there is one I didn't get here. I don't. I don't think I did. In the fog. Also, there's one between the Apostle and Landell. Like if you go up towards Landell, the outskirts. There's one there. Hmm. Yeah, you know, let's. I guess we'll just get the one in Gelmir. How far would it be? Are we gonna go past the Falling Star Beast? It's kind of far. 
but it's fine. We'll just get this one. We do the one in seat water. I wish I had a better grace closer to that. Yeah, the slander's massive. And then we gotta go to the Church of Inhibition. I keep forgetting about that. I just noticed how curved the nose looks. Look how bent that is. On this mask. Is this where the merchant is? I think it's right here, right? Yeah. Oh, welcome, dear customer. Hey, I'm no customer of yours. I was thinking about it yesterday, watching the uh, Summer Game Fest showcase. And, like, there's so many games nowadays where just, like, the dialogue, I feel like, turns me off to the game. Especially in trailers. Like, they just, like... I don't know, it makes me appreciate Elden Ring that much more, you know? Because, like, there's so much of this game that you just don't hear any dialogue and you're just kind of exploring. But, like, whenever you have, like, a protagonist who just, like, has these quick one-liners, like... It's like the gameplay can be so good for those games, and then you hear that, and it's just like, ah, please shut up now. Alright, we're ignoring this dude. I don't know why I randomly thought of it. The merchant somehow reminded me of it. I guess because he was talking. And it's, it's something that, like, never really annoyed me until probably recently. But, like, when you have a character that you're, you're playing as that just constantly, like, says stuff to, like, remind you of things, it's like, ugh. That stuff would just drive me nuts now. Like, how God of War was, basically. When Atreus tells you you're on fire, but you probably already knew that. It's like, yeah, thanks. I did. And should we kill the Elserated Tree Spirit? Eh. Gonna pass. I don't think he gives a golden seed, this one. So what do we need? We need two more or one more? Need one more. Uh, let's go back here then. It's probably a better one to get, but whatever. The, the Galmir one was, like, super out of the way. I don't think I got the one... I, I knew, There's going to be one here no matter what. Like, that I know I didn't get. So... The three is bad for that? Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, it was just something like I never like that never really bothered me, but it does now. That's one thing Borderlands One didn't have either. Like Borderlands One, the characters never talk to you. Like they say like almost nothing. And then BL2, they just kind of had Handsome Jack in the area the whole time, which is fine because Handsome Jack was like a strong character. But I guess if it's not a strong character, it's not so great. Where is the golden seed? Here it is. Might as well grab the other one too. It is tempting to go for 14, but... Wait, is it up here? Oh yeah, I guess it is. How many times I heard Clam Trap tell me climb up there? Yeah. But like, I don't know, man. I think developers just a lot of times want to handhold people who play games. Because they don't want them to get frustrated and quit. And then Elden Ring comes out with this massive open world game that does not hold your hand. It's one thing, like a Souls-like is one thing, because, you know, it's a little more linear. Or like, you know what I mean, like, like some of the other Souls games. They're far more linear, but this game's just so open. To have a game this open and have that not be a thing is, I, th I feel massive. Okay, I did get this one. All right, where do we want to go then? So, eh, maybe it's, we shouldn't even get another one. I guess we'll, oh yeah, Church of Inhibition and then God's Can Duo. I want to go here. Now nah, we'll go here. Status. Death. It's weird that death is a status. But also, like, death. <laughs> I guess that the status leads to death. Pentiment has a good dialogue, but it's uh, a lot of dialogue, but it's good dialogue. No, well, that's different, though. Murder mystery. Like, it. it's... It's like when characters try too hard to be funny... Which I think happens in a lot of AAA titles. I mean, that's something Borderlands has always been guilty of. Borderlands 3, I think, was a big offender, though. Like, sometimes, I guess, for me, the humor just misses the mark, you know? It's the marvelization of, of gaming, really. I think is what it comes down to. And some people love it, some people are totally fine with it, and then others, like, despise it. Shot Through the Heart singing on the Summer Game Fest trailer. Yeah. What game? I don't even remember what game that was for. Madness. This is a minor thing, I guess, but like it really bothers me when you get like a fantasy RPG trailer and they're playing like anything that doesn't fit the time period. <laughs> I don't know why. It just it, it irks me so much. John Carpenter game. Oh, yeah, right. The Zombie Slayer clone number 500. They built it up like it was going to be a horror game and then it's just basically just killing zombies. Sacred Tear. All right, we got bike here. Oh, nice. 
this. Can this man bleed? Great. All right, I guess we'll go back to God's Can Do it then. I can't think of anything else I'd want other than another flask, but I'm not going to bother with that now. We got 13 flasks at plus 12 compared to, I think we had nine at plus nine. We have way more health. No more damage, but that's, you know, not going to get much more damage anyways. So we want to take this off or this. These look good. This is, I don't know. I don't think the Ritual Sword Talisman is going to be, like, huge here. It's, like, as soon as I get hit, it's pretty much useless, but... Let's give it a try, shall we? Actually, hang on. Physic. Physic. I gotta remember. Physic. I could get maybe, like, a better Physic tier 2. Like, the... The regen one would be good. But for now, we'll just do this. Basically have 14 heals, and the physic heal is going to be, I think, really good. Level am I at? Status, 86. Oh, there goes my damage. Well, I got the bleed, though. I just can't punish him. I get, like, 25%. It's either, like, 25 or 30% more damage for 20 seconds after I bleed something. Attacks here. Oh, nice. Blood attacks when he gets out of this. Which should be any second. There we go. Jesus. Take your time, buddy. Ah, oh, crap. This is the first heal I've used. Did it really? I didn't think that reach, dude. That AoE is massive. Blood tax. Oh, 
Nice. Yeah, dude, repost. Are you kidding me? I think it was like too high because of the stairs or something. Actually miss. Dude, this, this guy's so annoying to fight. Oh my god. Phase two, buddy. Oh, he's already in phase two. Wow, okay. Didn't even do the transition. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, I can't punish that, unfortunately. I mean, it's definitely going way better than before. Nice. I missed, of course. Yeah, but I was really hoping I can get R2 off. I'm trying to stun him. Perfect. Right there. Okay, so yeah, now we're gonna get the Apostle by himself. I think. If you if you stagger the Noble or the Apostle while they're summoning the other guy, like, they won't summon them, I'm pretty sure, at all. Maybe there's like a time limit or something where they will... Oh, dude, why does that do so much damage? Man, it's sad when an R2 does 121 damage. rolling. Full health. Looking good. Nice. Oh, I swear if I could strafe that. I might be able to. I just, uh... I needed to get around him more. 
You throw a fireball? Oh, dude. Careful. Covered in blood. <laughs> you can imagine how awful this would be without bleeds, though. I need you guys to separate. I need another bleed is what I need. You guys are doing a really bad job of separating. Thank you. That's bad. Man, we're not gonna get another bleed, are we? We gotta actually whittle them down. Probably better to go for the Apostle, because strike damage I don't think does very much in the Noble, but you know, he's here, so I'm just gonna... Never mind. Thanks for the roll game. Dude, like, Jesus Christ! Am I gonna bleed? No? Wow, I got a stagger. No bleed, though. I'm not dead. Jesus. Get me out of here. Alright, uh, arcane, I guess, because... What else are we going to do? We could do endurance, but... Arcane is good.